Is wood movement a myth? Let me show you three examples here in my home. This was made in the humid season. We are now in the dry season. The door is made out of plywood, which is stable, but I cut solid walnut to use as veneers for the front. And as you can see, we lost an eighth of an inch up top as well as down below. This could have been prevented if I would have cut thinner veneers and used a stronger glue. This is a dining room table I made a few years ago and I knew this would happen. I just didn't know how much. It is made with five different species and each species expands and contracts at different rates. As you can see, it's solid up here and then we have gaps down here as well as over here. This is a panel door that is made for expansion and contraction. If this was a solid piece of wood, you would not be able to open and close it in the summertime. These panels here fit loose within the frame and it allows expansion and contraction. This was painted in the summer. Now that it's winter, things have shrunk and I can see the raw wood in here. 